Uh, good morning, good afternoon. This is your live streamer, Freeman Sullivan. And we're here in San Francisco at 850 Bryant Street. Uh, we're here for a Black and Brown United demonstration uh, protesting the murders uh, over the last year of O'Shane Evans, Luis Gangora, Alex Nieto, Jessica Williams, and Mario Woods. Uh, there's been a spate of police killings here in San Francisco uh, that have led to a hunger strike, um, have led to regular protests, um, and today there is going to be a march that's coming from this direction over here in the Mission, I do believe, and that should uh, should be coming up on here uh, shortly, so uh, stick around for the live stream, and uh, please log on and let me know how the uh, stream's coming out, because, you know, this being San Francisco, supposedly the tech capital of the world, they have really shitty bandwidth, and the internet really sucks here, so, uh, you know, it's a contradiction in terms, right? Well, anyway, uh, just let me know what's going on, log on to the chat, or the uh, social stream, and uh, let me know what's up. So we should have some speakers up here around 12 o'clock when we get started. Um, hey, what's up? Kenneth Harding Jr. is another name that we can add to the list. Uh, you know, basically, uh, San Francisco police were so out of control. Uh, we have a lot of problems in addition to the police murders that are going on here. We have police officers that are texting racist texts. We have police officers that are engaging uh, in sex with underage uh, women. And, uh, you know, the whole police department could really use a makeover. They're trying to find a police chief right now, and it's all been done in secrecy. Uh, so, you know, it seems like the police, police commission is headed down to the same path of secrecy and lies that they've always been headed down. And we're not going to get the police chief we want here in San Francisco. Uh, basically, it's going to be more bullshit and more bullshit and more lies. That's just my personal opinion. But we'll see what happens. But meanwhile, we have to keep up the pressure on the police department uh, because, you know, these uh, these people that are getting murdered by San Francisco police and by police around the country, uh, they're more than just hashtags. You know, we have families of people who have been murdered by police. And, you know, it, the hurt keeps going on. The hurt keeps giving. I mean, these people have to live for years and years, a whole lifetime of hurting because of the uh, irresponsible just, actions just. of a few police officers. Well, I should say the whole police department. Uh, well, looks like we're going to get some speakers here real soon. Brothers and sisters, we have everyone attention. We want to start gathering in front of the Hall of Justice here in an orderly fashion. We want to make sure block the sidewalk as much as possible. And let's also be aware of the entrance. We want to keep the entrance clear on both sides as much as possible. So if we can just fall in over here to your left, to my right, we really appreciate it and we thank each and every one of you for coming out for this important, critical rally for justice. Come on family, let's do this. So it looks like we got a crowd of about 100, let's do this. about 100 people so far. Are you in the Justice move Memorial? In, we move in as much as uh, I'm on the list. I'm, I'm, make it over I'm here good. to my right, to your left. Thank you, though. So we got people are moving into place. Got about 100 people here. Uh, there is a march that was scheduled to join this one. I think some of the people that are here with Alex Nieto signs uh, were on a march. Fall in as much as possible. Again, we want to try to make sure that we keep the sidewalk as clear as possible so pedestrians can get back and forth as well as the two entrants here at the Hall of Justice. 
Pretty warm day out here for San Francisco standards. And it gets real hot in front of 850 Bryant right around 12 noon. And we're going to see if we can get up here a little closer to what's going on. If I can. Ugh, crap. Pardon me. So it looks like I'm after the. Looks like they got too many people up here on the, the platform. Okay, family. What's possible? Fall in. Yeah, naturally, all the spots have been taken by all the people that are trying to get through. Anyway, if you're just joining us, this is your live streamer, Freeman Sullivan. Thanks for joining us. Uh, we're here out in front of 850 Bryant in San Francisco at the Thomas K. Thomas J. Cahill Hall of Injustice. Right, this is the place where people go to court and uh, where most of the injustice of society. So we'd like to welcome each and every one of you to uh, this rally, this important rally today here in front of the Hall of Justice. My name is Daniel Mohammed. I'm a member of the Justice Memorial Woods Coalition. We are honored for the presence of the mothers of the victims who have lost their lives at the hands of law enforcement here in this city. We want each and one of you to understand and know the critical nature of this event that's taking place today. Give yourself a round of applause for being here and showing up for justice. What do we want? When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Justice! When do we want it? Now! What do we want? Justice! When do we want it? Now! Thank you! <laughs> we don't come out here today to play games. Come on. Right! We out here today to make and send a clear message right. to District Attorney George Gascon that we want justice. What is justice? That's a great question. Justice. Do unto others what you would want like to be done unto yourself. The root of the problem here in San Francisco is that the San Francisco Police Department have caught blunts impunity to kill without any consequences. None. None whatsoever. Justice is putting these police officers in jail. Justice is giving these officers what's been given to us. Charge these officers was murdered. Prosecute these officers who have taken the lives of our loved ones here in San Francisco. These officers need the death penalty. Come on. They need the death penalty. Anytime you will shoot a human being, Alex Nieto, Mario Woods, like an animal, this is not the country, the nation that we want to live in. And the people can only call in justice. So we want you to know very clear, Mario Woods coalition as well as all the other coalition, Alex Nieto coalition, Emil Carr, Lopez coalition, Luis Gungor coalition, is fighting for justice for all of us. And again, we know that the duty of the civilized is to teach the savage. This department has gone mad. When do we want it? What do we want? Justice. When do we want it? Now. So we're doing some housekeeping here. We need We need you to understand, DA Gascon, that we have given you over 10 months to make a decision. That's too long. So now as we go into the anniversary of the execution of Mario Woods, 
how can we allow a DA to not make a decision that's so important that's sending a shockwave through this nation? Black people, brown people, poor white people want justice. And the only way we can get justice is we got to stand for truth. So now, my introduction is over. Bring up the Archbishop to open us up in prayer, and then we're going to have... <laughs> We turn it over to Archbishop. Thank you. I prayed before I came down here. You understand? And I hope the rest of you pray because it's going to take a God to bring about what we need. I want these folks walking the prison yard or on, on PC. Come on. There's been a murder, assassination take place. Yeah, I'm going to move around to see if I get you guys a better view here. We're no longer going for this study till this thing is over with. See, this is like cow dung, you know, you leave it in the field long enough and it dries up and it blows away. But pardon the me, pardon me. The pain of these mothers and this family is not blowing away. The anger of this community is not blowing away. There's blood in the street. So I'm going to see if I can get up front here, folks. Just a second. Now that Pardon me. Yeah. Right behind you, bro. I get up. Pardon me. We're not letting these officers that murdered our children get away with that. Right. We are all connected. As one body, I don't care what name you call it, if it's Luis, if it's Hardy, if it's Alexis, if it's Mario Woods, you got to see that this community is bound together of one accord and of one mind, yes, right. and that mind is to put pressure on this city, put pressure on Kamala Harris, yes. put pressure on Obama, put pressure on Lynch. She might need to change her name. How you gonna be talking about you for justice and your name is Lynch? <laughs> Black and brown people all over this country. We gonna do something about your people. That's right. Yes, yes, sir. Another thing that we need to be clear about: this building. Have you seen what they got wrote on the side of this building about justice, equal justice for all? Some of us have had to go through the doors. Some of us have had to go in their courtrooms, and very few of us found any justice. So justice is not going to come out of that lying mouth. When you start talking about the DA is moving into the what we will compare him with say. Don't y'all get quiet now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Why Satan? Because Satan make promises, but he don't deliver. Now, he's right. going to talk to good folk, but he Hello. ain't walking the walk. Yeah. And yeah. Too, he arrests these officers for murder. Oh, yeah. 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 For murder. Yeah. 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 is on the books, and that's what we want to see happen. That's right. Yeah. Who else is coming up here? I'm gonna come up and come on. We're gonna bring up the person that don't need to be introduced. I'm gonna gonna let them know who's here. Okay, well don't take too long. I'm not gonna take too long, sister, because what they don't know, they're getting ready to find out. That's right. We have Elaine Brown here with this comrade Elaine Brown. Yeah! Uncompromising revolutionary. And let us say what we're here for today because we don't want to get it twisted. We're not here to cry. Right. We're here to beg. Right. We're here to make a demand. Right. And the demand is that Gasco.
song, you need to come on out that office. Right. And stop playing around. Right. And charge these police with the murder of Mario Woods. This is the mother of Mario Woods. Yeah. Right. Uh, these police with the murder of Alex Diego. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, you in the center?
at 850 Bryant. I think what we need to have is the voice of one of the mothers on the bar. I know, I left mine in the name of our coalition, our beautiful sister and mother, the mother of Mario Woods, who's standing out here in front of us, ready to fight just like the rest of us. Let us give a powerful welcome to Sister Gwen Wood. Y'all are really okay. weak. This is Gwen Woods. Come on! Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. That's all right. This is just wow. There's several things I have to say because in the last three weeks, things that transition nationwide. Turn it up. When I saw the Turn it up. Turn it up. My baby was my baby was right next to me. 155, 60 wet and dry. And of course, you could talk him off the ledge. This is the plan. No, I want her to see this. No. I know what it is. Oh. I'm down running the show. Yeah, thank you. That's right. Go ahead. You can do that, too. Yeah, that's right. Gerald, those cops. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's When Daddy City picked up. Thank you so much. From there, with a knife, they shoot him in the arm. They take a man. Aww. Down in, of course, the... Talking to the mic. Caucasian man that dropped, thanks, thanks God. Mm -hmm. He was able to walk out of that to tell his story. I just wish to God. Hold it, hold it. 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 You can't wrestle with that because you have to think, and I'm not going to let you get off the hood of San Francisco with this. No, and that's right. Roll up in this grave. Yeah. You right. complained about Kaepernick not standing, but let me tell you, my dad was named by Kaepernick. Right. 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 He left Beaumont Texas to the South to fight for the same reason that Sean Hall did. Right. 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 Right.